So the new door gunner monkey knowledge is one of the coolest things added in this new update but I wanna know what this guy can really do, which towers can he move, uh, can he move heroes, temples, what's the best tower to have inside the heli, uh, do buffs remain and stuff like that, so let's test out everything together. So first up, uh, I heard of a bug of him being able to move ground towers to the water, so let me just check real quick if that's still possible, let's just pick up the sniper and see what's gonna happen. Nope. Okay, so I guess they got fixed. Well, actually, I saw a little tick here at the top right corner. Can you guys see that? So what's gonna happen if I click this green thing? Oh, nothing's happening. I cannot click it. But I can when it's here. Okay, so I guess that got fixed. I don't know. So next up, uh, while we are at the water and water towers, it would make no sense that he can pick up a submerged sub, right? Let's test that out, because there, there's no, no water in the heli, right? So let me just see if that's possible. So 400, uh, let me refresh the cooldown on that one. And he absolutely can. Oh my god, where's the water dude though? Look, oh, he, he looks so cool, look at this. Let's send in, let's send in round 98, sure. Okay, that's a bad round actually. Let's send in, um, I'm gonna just send in a couple of purple balloons. Oh, but that's kind of counterintuitive though, because the sub wants uh, balloons inside its range and the heli keep is uh, blowing them back, right? But um, it looks very cool though, it looks very cool. Okay, let me just drop this sub off and... Um, let's test out heroes now, can we pick heroes? I don't think so, I don't think we can pick up heroes. Uh, the monkey knowledge description, I think it says only towers, but let me try, let me just click the button, nope. So it doesn't appear. Let me click on path. I uh, cannot make this tower door gunner. Okay, so we cannot pick up heroes. And while we're at not being able to pick up stuff, I guess, let me try a temple. I'm very curious about uh, being able to pick up a temple because if we could pick up a fully buffed temple, that would just be insane, right? No, cannot make this tower a door gunner. All right. So, um,. A big one would be taking towers that can already fly, right? Especially the Ace and especially the, the Spectre, right? Because the Spectre's main problem is that... Well, let me just buy it and well, talk to you guys while I, uh, while I uh, do this. So the Spectre's, I guess, biggest problem is its weird flight patterns, right? So we got the Circle, we got the Figure Infinite, the Figure 8. And what this means is that it usually misses a lot of its shots and while the new Wing Monkey uh, monkey knowledge is very cool. It would be awesome if we could pick it up, right? So let me just try and pick up. No, it cannot. It cannot make this tower do gonna That would be that would have been so awesome though, because um, it's gonna fully use its pierce, right? And it's gonna be super cool. But I guess we cannot take in another heli. That would be heliception. So third tier heli. Nope, we cannot pick it up. Yeah, that would be too weird actually. Okay, so let's try using abilities now. Uh, can we use abilities from the tower that is inside? I think I just clicked something here. Drag and drop, yeah. Let me just click there. Okay, so can we use abilities from towers that are inside the heli? Uh, let's refresh the cooldowns and check this one out. So, pick it up. Oh no, the ability disappears. Huh. Okay, but what if... I've got another idea. I've got an idea. So, what if I do this? Uh, I'm going to give the order for the heli. I'm gonna have the heli like right here in the top right corner I'm gonna give him the order to pick up this monkey the ice monkey But then I'm gonna open the menu and as you guys can see here at the menu uh, The ability icon shows as well. So if we can keep the menu open that means we can still click the ability, right? So let's just do this. I've got this guy clicked on and the menu disappears while well, they thought of it That was so nice. Okay, so we cannot use abilities. Okay, but um, what's gonna happen if we try to sell the Chinook while it has a tower inside? Does the tower disappear or it just gets dropped? So uh, let's let's sell the Chinook like, uh, I don't know, like here. Okay, so the tower disappears as well. That's that's interesting. That's good to know. So we can, we can basically lose the tower, right? If we do this. All right, so uh, next up, let me see if buffs keep if the towers basically keep their buffs, so let me just promote this guy and let's refresh the cooldowns and pick him up. So he's got promo brew now and 
Well, there is a permabrew effect on the Chinook, but I think he just got... Oh, he didn't get buffed, so that's the Sniper actually, so Towers do keep their buffs inside. And let's just drop him out, see if he still has the buffs. Oh, that's weird, he only keeps the AMD though. <laughs> that's... I guess that's a bug, so he only keeps the AMD, he doesn't keep the, um, the Berserker Brew. Okay, so that's interesting to know. And the last thing that I wanted to check out, well, I, I have an idea about this, and that, that is what's the best tower to have inside, and I would say that that's the Dark Champion, right? Because he's by far the best DPS tower to have, since we cannot take in temples. So let me just sell everything and see the difference between him, uh, him just attacking as it is, placed on the ground somewhere, and uh, him inside the heli. So let's just have the heli lock in place here and I'm gonna place him right here I'm gonna buy a 204 dark champion and send him around 98 and see how he does so do I think that he's gonna pop everything I'm not sure I really hope he does but we can also check out where the balloons are gonna are gonna end up eventually and we can also use the teleport I'm not sure if we want to use that though well it's his ability so I guess we should right Oh, it's getting a little bit messy with these ceramics though. Is he gonna defend? Nope, he's gonna leak. He's leaking a lot of lives. That's some major leakage right there. Is he gonna leak more though? I don't think so. I think he's got this. Oh, never mind. That's a little bit more. And there is this huge wave. Let me just teleport him over there. Is he gonna defend this? That was a bad teleport for me. That was I grieved a little bit. But he's still leaking a ton, so. I guess no. Okay, so I'll just pick him up now with the heli and see how he does versus 98 again. Uh, let me have the heli in pursuit and let's go. Yeah, there we go. This is so much better actually. Yeah, this is gonna fix a lot of a lot of towers problems if you if you pick uh, the tower up inside the heli because this way it uses its pierce fully, so it's shooting down a straight line. Um, that's the that's basically along the track and if they are placed like here they are basically shooting from the sides they're not shooting well let me just buy it again and show you guys what i mean so he's shooting from the side right now he's not shooting in a straight line and that's the difference between having him inside the heli and uh, having him outside but um yeah I, I guess the 204 dark champion is the best tower to have by far the best dps to have inside but i guess the arcane spike is gonna do nice as well and uh, what are tower? I guess you know what would, would be cool the destroyer would be cool to have inside wait can we pick up an aircraft carrier though oh let's check that out let me drop this guy and let's pick up an aircraft carrier if we can oh we cannot so that's the fourth tier that we cannot pick up I guess it's because it has these little um, monkey aces these little spawns so maybe that's the reason why we cannot pick it up but um, yeah, that was kind of this, uh, I guess, science, Mythbusters or whatever you want to call it episode about this new door gunner monkey knowledge. I think it's very cool. I think it's it's a super cool addition to, to the game. And uh, yeah, hopefully we are going to make some use of it in the future. So thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.